All right. We have degoogled. We have moved away from big tech tyranny, spyware, Apple Store, and the invasive Google spyware, Google Play, and uh, well, one thing we lose though is the voice to text or speech to text. So we're going to look at one option here, and called the app is called Sayboard. All right, so we're going to go from start to finish. We're going to go find it in F Droid. All right. Again, it's just spelled just like it sounds. Say board, open source. All right, let's install that. It also can be found on Droidify. It's just a faster, cleaner, more private version of uh, F-Droid uh, with many options, different repositories you can add where you can fetch different apps from. All right, so let's go ahead and hit the install on that and go ahead and open it up. Grant microphone permission, yes, of course. Enable keyboard, say board, yes. All right, and let's go find that. You can also access it through your texting app, but we will go here first. And I guess we're already there. Oh, what? Okay, so uh, first we need to download a, uh, a VOSC uh, English. Uh, VOSC is, this, this is the speech recognition toolkit, um, so we don't have to communicate with Google. And we will wait for this to download. All right, good to go there. Peruse around here a little bit. Uh, let's see, uh, logic. Um, we'll start on the right side. Listen immediately. Um, you can play around with that if you want. Right now, when Sayboard comes up with this disabled, you have to click on record, which you'll see here in just a minute. Auto switch back. Um, I do like that to switch back to the keyboard after I'm done speaking. Auto capitalize to your preference, of course. And let's actually go look at it first and then we'll come uh, back to here. So let's open up our texting app. Generic texting here. Okay, keyboard I am currently using is just um, pretty sure the one I have with Lineage. I'm on the Lineage uh, operating system, by the way. And this can work with Calyx OS or uh, EOS, uh, also the Graphene OS phones. Um, you also have the option with the Graphene OS phones to um, uh, use the Gboard voice to text or Google Voice, whatever you want to call it. All right, so let's hit that, and you can see that we're ready to speak. So, yes, um, we are working. So cool, see? You can stop here if you wanted to. Turn that off. Uh, you can see on the right side are, let's see, some hyphen, hyphenations there, punctuations, exclamation mark, period, and comma on the left side. All right, so what you can do, uh, you can go back in the settings if you wish, and user interface, you can change all the colors. Um, and for the keyboard, um, the right keys, so there's exclamation mark and some other punctuation. Let's just delete those. And let's add a period, something that's used a lot. It is on the left side, but I'm just gonna show you how to do this because I like mine on the right side. Hit the plus button, don't hit okay yet. You want to add it first. All right, so this one, let's put a comma. You can label label whatever you want. The text is actually what shows up on your screen, so you can just put a C there if you wish. Let's add that, and then 
I'm going to put an S here for space. Blow that away. I'm going to hit spacebar twice just to make sure it works. Plus, and we're going to hit OK. So the right keys, it did take it. All right, so let's go back to the keyboard. Um, okay. Blow that away. And if you hit that microphone, you can see that they changed over here. Sometimes the layout is just one, two, three. Uh, for some reason, my lineage phone lays out a little bit different. So um, we could try it again. Yep, testing. One, two, three. And this is a little bit uh, not intuitive, obviously, as Gboard. Um, because you can see this not turn the numbers to one, two, three or take period, if you say period, or exclamation mark, that's why it's handy to have these. So um, not quite as user-friendly, but hey, it's a lot more private and uh, open source, which uh, allows everyone to view the code. Let's turn that off, because I don't need to record all that. All right, so um, there you have it. Uh, we now have voice to text back on our D Google phone, and uh, I hope this is helpful. Have a wonderful day.